The Attorney General of the Federation, Mr. Latif Fagwimi S.A.N., has vowed to uphold fairness, justice, and the rule of law. He noted that the contributions of every Nigerian to promote justice would no doubt reposition all sectors of the country for better results. Mr. Fagwimi said this in Adoikiti during a reception organized in his honor by the founder of the Afe Babalola University, R.A. Afe Babalola. Fagwimi spent 15 years of his legal practice in Chief Babalola's chambers. The minister is the second product of the chambers to be appointed Attorney General of the Federation and Minister for Justice, the first person being Chief Akin Olujimi, S.A.N. I said it is a challenge because I know hopes are high. You have to do something. You don't just uh, savour the encomiums without looking at the flip side. The flip side is the challenge that the appointment has posed, the challenge that the office has raised, the expectation of the people. And that is why I mentioned the other day that you don't just come out and say, this is what I will do. You must also follow up with how you will do it. And that's why all the, stake, the critical stakeholders have been engaged to have their input, harmonize the views, then come out with what I will call a blueprint, all along the line of Mr. President Hope Aj in his address of welcome, Ariafe Babalola described Fagbemi as an uncommon man doing uncommon things and achieving uncommon results. He repeated his call for a new constitution that will mandate political office holders to treat their offices as an avenue for rendering service to the people and not for making money. It is a common saying that when a person had a heavy suffocating debt, he does not only lose his sleep, he cannot plan for any capital investment. This is why many Nigerians, including my humble self, are beholding the government to tackle the fundamental structures that have caused the inequality and poverty in the country. Why the government may be studying the situation the truth is that Nigerians are becoming more and more impatient. The longer they desert, we should not treat leprosy with the drugs meant for scapegoats. Chief is a talent hunter, a slave driver, but he also cares about the genome in his chambers. Because for a man to have served in a place and refused to leave, there must be something juicy in that chamber. Apart from learning law, I'm sure that uh, personally he must have seen some improvement in his personal lifestyle. And after becoming SCN, he spent extra five years in that chamber. Not all mentors, and I repeat, not all mentors will share spaces with their mentees. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.